Hello and welcome back to the Irvington Public Library. This is another story time with Miss Chima. Today we're going to be reading The Little Red Hen by Baron Banton. Before we start, let's sing our story time song. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Clap your hands. Clap your hands. Okay. So, we're going to be reading The Little Red Hen by Baron Banton. Once there were four friends. The pig, the dog, the cat, and the little red hen. The little red hen had three baby chicks. See them? One, two, three. One day, the little red hen was pecking in the ground. And she found some seeds. See the seeds? She went to her three friends and asked, who will help me plant these seeds? Not I, squealed the pig. Not I, quacked the dog. Not I, meowed the cat. The then I will plant the seed, said the little red hen. And she did. And the seed sprouted and grew into large stalks of wheat. Then the little red hen asked her friends, Who will help me cut these stalks of wheat? Not I, meow the cat. Not I, squat, squeak the pig. Not I, quack the duck. Then I will cut the wheat, said the little red hen. And she did. The friends are not helping and it's not nice. The little red hen then asked her friends, Who will help me stretch this wheat? Not I squeal the pig. Not I quack the dog. Not I meow the cat. Then I will stretch the wheat, said the little red hen. And she did. Then the little red hen asked her friends, who will help me grind these grain of wheat into flour? Not I squeal the pig, not I quack the duck, not I meow the cat. What are they doing? They're playing, flying kite and having fun. Then I will grind the wheat into flour, said the little red hen, and she did. Then the little red hen asked her three friends, who will help me make this flour into bread? Not I, meow the cat. Not I, Peel the pig, not I quack the duck. Then I will make the flour into bread, she said. And she did. She baked the bread in the oven. Then the little red hen called to her friends. Who will help me eat this bread? What do you think they will say? I will quack the duck. I will meow the cat. I will 
kill the pig. Do you think she will let them? Let's see. Let's find out. Oh, no, said the little red hen. We will eat the bread. Who is we? She, she was going to eat the bread with her three little chicks. And they did. The end. You see, the friends didn't help and she did not want to share. I think that's fair. So you help your friends so that you can enjoy with your friends. Thank you very much for listening and I hope you are enjoying the stories. And I will see you again very, very soon. Thank you again and bye.